In this week's Wellness Wednesday, expert answers when it comes to the COVID-19 vaccine and pregnant women. Some who are expecting may be afraid to get the shot, fearing that it could impact their unborn baby. We talked with Intermountain Healthcare to set the record straight. All the information that we have right now would suggest that receiving the vaccine during pregnancy is safe. Dr. Sean Esplin is the senior medical director for women's health at Intermountain Healthcare. He says while there hasn't been a study on the COVID-19 vaccine conducted specifically on pregnant women, about 30 women included in both Moderna and Pfizer studies were pregnant at the time. In the end, those women had no issues after receiving their shot. The mRNA type vaccine theoretically shouldn't cause any problem. It shouldn't cross the placenta. It shouldn't affect the baby in any way. When it comes to side effects, many of them after getting the vaccine are similar to ones that pregnant women may experience. Headaches, soreness, fatigue. But Dr. Esplin says that's entirely normal and that those things should subside within 24 hours after getting the vaccine. It's not actually a cause for alarm if you're having those kind of side effects. It actually means that the vaccine is working and that your body is mounting an immune response. I just took Tylenol and then was able to rest. I never got a fever or any more side effects than that, and it was fine. Katie Hansen is a labor and delivery nurse at Logan Regional Hospital. She's 36 weeks pregnant and received her second dose of the Pfizer vaccine earlier this month. While Katie jumped at the chance for the vaccine, she says getting vaccinated is a personal decision everyone needs to make. In my case, I felt like I needed the vaccine because I am at a job where I couldn't work remotely. I knew I was going to be in contact with people whenever I was at work and um, sometimes I would know their COVID status, sometimes I wouldn't. And so it was it was a really good choice for me and my OBGYN recommended it. Absolutely. The best thing to do is to talk to your midwife or your doctor about whether the vaccine is right for you. And even after you get both shots of the COVID-19 vaccine, Dr. Esplin urges people to still do their part to keep others safe from the virus. Wearing a mask, social distancing, washing your hands. All good reminders there. Uh, doctors do recommend the vaccine for people older than 35, as well as people who are overweight and people with pre-existing conditions like diabetes or hypertension. Uh, the CDC, among other groups, also recommend women get the shots if COVID-19 transmission is high in their community.